For this tutorial, I am using an old broken network cable. First, remove the broken head of the cable. Now, insert the strain relief boots. Next, remove the protection layer of the cable without damaging the inner wires. Next, separate all the tangled wires and straighten them. Now, arrange the wires according to the color scheme shown in the image. Next, snip a short length of the wires to get a clean and straight arrangement. Now, carefully insert the wires into the RJ45 pass-through connector. Now, double-check the wire order and pull the connector until the outer protection layer is inside the connector. Next, use a pass-through crimping tool to crimp the RJ45 connector. After crimping, slide the strain relief boot to finish your cable end. For people using a regular or a non-pass-through connector. The only change you need to make is while snipping. Keep the length of the wire less than the connector length. Next, crimp the connector using a regular RJ45 crimping tool and insert the strain relief boot. Now, to test the cable, connect the wire to the master and remote of the network cable tester and then turn it on. Now, if your LED sequence on the master matches the LED sequence on the remote, like in the video, the network cable is good.